Then it goes a little something like this. Hey guys, so there's a really big lace-up tea trend that's going around and I absolutely love it. I own so many of those shirts now, it's starting to become a slight problem. But I thought it'd be super cool to make a concert tee that's distressed with a different take on the lace-up because next week is the tea week and I was trying to get some outfit inspiration um, so that I can stand out and still um, you know, be casual enough to fit in, but different enough to stand out. Um, so this is my Drake concert shirt I got from his Nothing Was The Same tour a few years ago. Um, and I honestly only wore it to sleep because it was a plain shirt and I wasn't really sure what to do with it. And I was sitting in my room and I just thought like, why don't I cut, you know, the front neck so that it's like a lace-up shirt, but not. Um, so that's what I did, and if you want to get this look, just go ahead and keep watching. First, you'll want to go ahead and take your shirt and fold it in half vertically. You can do this by matching the neck seam and the shoulder seam. This is important so that when you start your cuts, they're even across the chest instead of lopsided, more to the right or left. Your first cut should start at the seam of the neckline. Every cut after should be about half an inch wide. And for this particular shirt, I'm gonna go ahead and make the cuts closer to the neckline longer and narrow them down as I get to about just above half of the shirt. On this side, we have some widely contrasting examples taken from recent recordings to give you some idea of the wealth of recorded music now available on the wider tapestry of stereophonic sound. So now that I'm finished making my cuts, I'm going to go ahead and open the shirt. And I'm checking to make sure that my cuts are still um, center on the right and left side of the chest. And if they're not, I'm going to cut a little wider. And next, I'm going to start pulling the strands so that they become thinner, and that's um, what's going to give it the distressed look. 